Good morning. Happy Thursday, November 9th. I am your host of the Daily Hot Sheet for Roswell, Georgia, Tanya McLeod. Thank you so much for coming back. Wanted to jump on in and take a look at what is going on in Roswell. But before we do that, let's go check out and see what the mortgage rates have done since yesterday. So I always start out at my website and go to my blog and I look for, whoops, it didn't look like I hit the blog. Hold on, blog. And um, you can click into one of the most recent ones with the updates even from yesterday. And I'll have the daily mortgage rate here in the mortgage calculator. So let's go click to the daily mortgage rate. Yesterday looks like uh, on the 8th we were at, oh, I didn't write it down. So we were at 7.46. We are down again. We are at uh, 7. Let me give a little, see if it will. No confetti. Okay. We are at 7.41. So that's good. We love when they're starting to go down. So 7.41. And let's just see what's been going on here in the last uh, 24 hours. This is what I like to look at. So we've had five new listings come on the market yesterday. We also had five. So this is great. Um, none came back on the market, meaning no, none of the um, ones that were under contract or pending came off. So that's good. We had two more that decreased in pricing. Nobody increased. We had four go pending. So look, as soon as they come on the market, they're going pending. Um, no, none went on hold. We did have one that withdrew and we had uh, five that closed. So again, these are just going out of con, you know, under con. Oh, look at this! Five active or four active under contract, in addition to four pending. So the way we talked about that was that um, once you go under contract, that means that you have the inspection time period you're working through, and then once you get those all resolved, then it drops down to complete pending. So active under contract and pending, they're both uh, under contract. So we've got eight right now. Um, and then one coming soon. So if I just go right here quick to the Roswell uh, hot sheets in the last 24 hours, and I can send you a copy of this. Is this something that you'd like to see? This talks about the new listings that we have, the ones that have decreased in pricing. So we can kind of see, let me just decrease the size of this. So we can see uh, what subdivision, the price points that we're talking. And here is the status. So you can see A green is they are still active. So a lot of these are our brand new ones on the market. This doesn't include all of them that have already been on the market. These are just the brand new to market in the last 24 hours. So if you want a full list of everything, comment down below, send me a DM and I'll be happy to get that to you. So we've had a couple that are considered new listings, Kings Mill, Horseshoe Bend, Litchfield, and Brookfield, uh, as well as a decrease in Willow Springs and in the Overlook. And then we had some others that went pending in Brookfield in the corner at Lake Charles. Four that closed were in Broughton Park, Clary Lakes, Inverness, and Hayden Hall. Uh, I know their neighbors. They're going to have some really good neighbors. And then uh, these three down here went active under contract. And uh, Golden Gate Estates, Burkdale, Crabapple, and Lock Highland. And then one coming soon is Willow Springs. Now, I think the difference from the other uh, ones is that this is only detached homes, meaning single family homes. And the other list that said there were four that were active under contract and four that were actually pending, they must be including the actual uh, t uh, attached homes as well. So that's the update for today. If you have any specific questions or would like a report for your specific market, please reach out, comment down below, send me a DM, text me, and I will love to have a cup of coffee with you to talk about why now is still a great time to buy and sell. Take care and enjoy the rest of your day.